I can't really uh, fully express to you how amazing it is uh, to be standing here speaking to you today from this podium. Um, this really is a beautiful audience and uh, it brings back incredible memories. Um, first, uh, I want to apologize to you uh, because I'm afraid that a third of you um, are going to feel that whatever I say um, doesn't entirely relate to you. And if I'm lucky, two thirds of you will think that what I am saying doesn't make sense at the best and at the worst, you'll think that I'm dead wrong. Um, but just keep in mind that I was here almost 24 years ago. Near the end of my Jesuit career, I joined the debate team. And again, this was, um, when I look back on it, I wish that I had joined that team in eighth grade. I wish that I had been involved in it in eighth and ninth grade. But I think somewhere in, you know, somewhere I lacked the confidence. Somewhere I just felt like, I don't know if I would be good at that, or I don't know if I want to get up and speak in front of people, or, you know, I'm good at arguing with my parents, so maybe I'd be a good debater, but maybe I don't want to debate my classmates or kids from other schools. Maybe I don't feel like that's something that I would be good at. Um, but at some point, I was encouraged to do it, um, and I'm thrilled that I did. Um, it made me vulnerable, as we talked about a little bit. It made me step out on a stage. It made me critically think. It made me figure out how to articulate the ideas that I wanted to express and also to take both sides of an issue and be prepared to argue either side. Pursuit of excellence is almost as important, maybe more important, than actually achieving excellence. It's the pursuit that makes it worth it. It's the pursuit that causes you to grow. It's the pursuit that gives you the opportunity to open all sorts of pathways and highways that you can follow as you move throughout your life. These, these activities taught me to respect the world around me and to find empathy for my fellow human. Um, empathy, another word I want you to take with you today. Empathy doesn't mean understanding everyone around you. It means trying to understand everyone around you. It means taking a moment to put yourself in their position to try to find a way to understand why they think the way they do, why they act the way they act, why they behave the way they behave, and why they do the things that they ultimately do. Not to judge, not to defeat them in some way, not to, you know, accomplish some mission, but simply for the mere benefit of understanding your fellow human and interacting with them in a way that is constructive for the community at large. Every field of study, whether you're a chef or a doctor or a lawyer or an engineer or you specialize in cybersecurity or you become a professor or a, a teacher, every single profession and every single job that you will ever engage in requires critical thinking and effective communication. And those things are, are taught in abundance at, at this school. Uh, they're highlighted. You're given all, many, many opportunities to engage. And I hope that you will look for them and continue to find them um, and put the onus on yourself to look, look for those, look for those opportunities to, to grow uh, to expand your horizons, but to critically think and effectively communicate. Sometimes we win, sometimes we lose, and sometimes it rains. And so what that means is you come back the next day and you show up and you keep fighting. It means that when there's a rain out, doesn't mean the game didn't happen. It means it's going to happen tomorrow means it's going to continue. It's cliche, but I have no doubt about it when I look out across you and see um, in your eyes and in your faces that everything in your wildest dream is accomplishable. And um, I'm certainly going to be there in this city and this community. If I can ever be of any help to any of you, please don't hesitate to, to let me know. So thank you for this great honor to be with you this morning. And please, if there are any questions, I'd be happy to 
to take them and, and engage with you guys for a little while. Thank you.